Yo, it is Earn with Todd back with another Kangaroo Hunter video. And in this video, I'm going to discuss the V concept when we're trading kangaroo tails. This will kind of increase our win rate as well as allow us to exit trades that are not quite going our way right away. So in this video, we're going to look at the most ideal kangaroo tail movements once you enter the trade. And we're going to discuss whether or not you should actually stay in the trade if it starts going sideways or just close it right away. So stay tuned and let's dive right in. Okay, so here I have the 15 minute chart up and we are looking at Euro GBP. This is actually a trade we were looking at on stream this morning on April 13th. And for those of you that are watching this or are brand new, I go live every single weekday on Twitch. I will have the link down below in the description along with the schedule. But here we have Euro GBP on the 15 minute chart. Here, this kangaroo looks really, really good right here. We can see that there's plenty of room to the left. Let me pull up my pen. So here is the first criteria we are looking for the, for the kangaroo tails. Is there plenty of room to the left? Yes, there is. Next criteria we look at, is it on a zone? And yes, this was on a zone. We pulled up the line chart and we actually zoomed out of here and uh, we backed up and we could see previously price has been there. So on stream, we considered that that was a zone. But as we zoom in, we can definitely see that this trade got triggered because on the next candle, we do see price go higher than the high of this bullish kangaroo. That's one of the criteria we need. And the ideal movement we want to see with the kangaroos is when it goes down like this and price goes straight up. So we got the V shape. And this is why I'm calling it the V concept. We want price immediately, okay, if we see a bullish kangaroo, we want it to go straight up. We do not want to see any of this sideways crap where it's like this. Okay, the second candle doesn't even go up. Third candle, a fourth candle. If you see it going down, this would be a good time to just exit the trade. In fact, personally, if you see it start going sideways, just exit the trade. Why? Well, it's going to prevent you from hitting your true stop loss, which is going to help you lose less money. So do not be afraid. If you do enter a kangaroo trade and it starts going sideways, do not be scared to just close it and take the small loss right away. Because let's zoom out. Let's go to my favorite S&P 500. So here we are on the one minute chart on the S&P 500. This was a trade that I bagged like 160, 180 pips on stream live. So with this setup, we see the classic V shape. As soon as the kangaroo prints, we start going down. There's none of this sideways stuff for like three or four candles. It just starts going straight down. And this is the ideal movement that we need to see with the kangaroo. If it starts going sideways, close out those trades. Do not let it get to stop loss. And I know mentally it's hard to just close out a trade because you're like, oh man, if I close out early, it's probably going to start going the other directions. Well, guess what? There's going to be plenty of other kangaroo tails to find opportunity on. Let's back up a little bit and look at this. Here, I already marked this up earlier, but let's take a look at this kangaroo down here. Here we see the perfect bullish kangaroo. We got that classic V shape. It does come down and retest a little bit, but overall it goes straight up. And here's a good example for this next kangaroo. Here we see there's plenty of room to the left. In the next candle, this trade is triggered, but look, it's starting to go sideways. So after this third or fourth candle, if you start seeing this candle going up, you can close out before it actually hits your stop loss and you're gonna lose less money by following the V concept. Follow these V shapes like this and you will be fine. Do not be afraid to close out early losses. And just for a couple more examples, let me pull up some more Forex pairs on the 15 minute that we saw on one of the live streams. So here we have Euro odd and right away we can tell there is plenty of room to the left. That is no question. Okay, but the very next candle that trade would have been triggered. But look what happens. Price does this sideways action and it does not go straight up. So once again, ideally, if you see four or five candles go on like this, close out the trade because we did not catch the momentum shifter that we were looking for. Our goal with the kangaroo tail is to catch the main reversals, not this sideways stuff where we got to wait and wait and wonder. No, we want the instant movement close out those trades that do not start moving right away and your losses are going to be a lot smaller. There's no reason to let it just hit your stop loss. Look for the V action and you will have more profits. Our goal is to save money also while jumping on the opportunities that is going to make us catch those major reversals. But let's one more. So here this time I pulled up the NASDAQ 100 on the one minute. Here we have a one minute kangaroo. Boom does the classic V movement. Now, why should we just wait for the V movement? Well, let's measure some pips here. Here is a about a 75 pip stop loss on the one minute candle. And look, 
price just goes up 560 pips within 20 minutes. Price did not do the sideways action. No, nope. it took off and that's what we're looking for. We're looking for the kangaroos that are gonna jump the market. So with that said, this is all I have for this kangaroo tail training video. As always, if you wanna learn more, if you wanna get the most value out of learning how to trade kangaroo tails, make sure you join my free Telegram channel, The Kangaroo Hunter. I will have the links down below, as well as catching all of my live streams on Twitch. I'm live every single weekday, 6.30 a.m. Pacific to about 8.30 Pacific. And we're catching hundreds of pips on live stream. So there's gonna be no better training ground to learn how to hunt for these kangaroos than on my Twitch live streams. You're gonna get insane value. You're not gonna have to pay what I teach on stream is exactly how I trade. So thank you for watching this video. Drop some comments, show me some love on this video. And again, if you got any questions, feel free to contact me on Instagram. Thank you. And the kangaroo hunter is signing off.